Okay, so what we're going to do is show you several different ways to determine if you have a round signal or if you have distortion. The first way we're going to do is by checking peak versus null. So we're in peak. We're going to find the center of our signal, which is right here. We're going to make note of that, and we're going to change to our null mode, which is right here. We're going to move the receiver back and forth until we find our null. So our null position and our peak position are exactly the same. So in that case, we're really comfortable we have a round signal. So the next thing we can do, since we're already in null, we're going to take the, the locator nulled out and we're going to pull it straight up. And as we pull it straight up, if it continues to be nulled out, we have a round signal. So we've had our second indication. The more difficult way to do this is triangulation with this equipment and a lot of the equipment because it doesn't allow for a 45 degree angle. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this piece of equipment, we're going to null it out, we're going to turn it to a prop approximately 45 degrees, and we're going to drag it over until it nulls back out, which is right about there. So we're going to make a mental note of that right there, see if we have something we can put on it. We're going to go back to the null position, turn it 45 degrees here. We're going to drag it back over. We're going to put it right about there, was where it nulled out. We're going to go back to our middle, and we're going to observe the distance. So if the distance is the same, we should have a round signal. In this case, it may have been 40 degrees one way and 50 the other, but we're really close. Uh, now, if if this is accurate, then half the distance would be our depth which in this case is a little under six feet, so that's really close. So that's a comfort level to us. So there's a couple other things we can do. We'll go back to uh, peak mode. We take a depth reading of five foot two. Now we're gonna pull it up a certain distance. We're gonna take another depth reading and it's five feet nine. We've moved it up about six inches or so. Another indication of round signal. And the last one we're gonna do is in peak mode. We're going to find our peak, we're going to take note of the signal strength, we're going to move it a fixed distance one direction and a fixed distance the other. The easy way to get the fixed distance is to lay the piece of equipment over on its side, which is about two feet, and pick it straight up. When we do that, in this case we're at 46-ish, we're going to come back over to the middle, we're going to lay it exactly the opposite. We're going to pick it up again, let it settle, we're right around 46. Again, just another indication of round signal. Now, you don't have to do all these, but these are just indications to help give you assurance that you're on a good round signal, which is important for quality information.